Hey everyone, Howler here, and first of all, Happy New Year! Yay! <laughs> there was an overwhelming response to our Ask Howler announcement video, and that made me just, like, amazingly happy. I am just so excited that people want to get involved in this segment. Um, so let's start the new year on the right paw, and get in and ask, answer some of your questions. <coughs> Our first question comes from Emily, who asked us over Facebook, Howler, how many different species of owl are there in North America? There are 19 of them, Emily, and they include the snowy owl, the great horned owl, the great gray owl, the barred owl, the barn owl, the flammulated owl, the Eastern Screech Owl, the Western Screech, the Whiskered Screech, the Northern Pygmy Owl, the Ferruginous Pygmy, the Northern Hawk Owl, the Burrowing Owl, the Boreal Owl, Long-Eared Owl, Short-Eared Owl, Spotted Owl, the saw -wet Owl, and the Elf Owl. Now, if you want to include some of the species that you find in Central America in your list of North American species, that'll actually bump up the number of species to about 37. That's quite a lot of owls. Now, most of those you're not going to see north of um, Mexico, but, um, you know, most of the owls on the list of 19 you will be able to see anywhere between Canada, the United States, um, and Mexico. So that was a really good question, um, and let's go on to another juicy one. This is from Tim, who asks, Howler, um, are wolves more or less active in the winter? Believe it or not, Tim, um, wintertime is actually our most active season, and that's because we have a double layer of fur. It keeps us warm, we just don't feel the cold unless it's like outrageously cold. Like, we're talking eh, like way down in the negatives. Um, so we're, we're fine until, you know, in weather that's so cold that the humans can't stand it. Um, now, the winter is also our most active month because this is breeding season for the alpha male and the alpha female. Um, so this takes place between December and February, and sometimes can go into March. Um, now this is a period of a lot of excitement for the pack, and once breeding season has ended, uh, springtime rolls around, and this is actually our least active season. We want to relax, we take it easy, because the pups are on their way, and once they're born, there's going to be a lot to do. Now our um, summer actually we try to take it easy in summer um, because, like I said, we have that double fur coat. It's hot. <laughs> um, so we try to take it easy during the summer because we don't want to get overheated. But yes, winter is awesome for wolves. We are perfectly fine out there in the cold. And um, <laughs> what more can I say about that? I bet you wish you had a nice coat of fur like I do, keeping you warm right about now. <laughs> Alright folks, thank you so much for your questions. Um, we'll have more, and obviously please keep the questions coming. Um, we want this to continue to be a thing. Um, these videos are going to be posted on all three of our Facebook pages, so no worries, you will find them. This will also get out on our YouTube pages and Twitter. Um, so if you do have questions to ask, just comment on the on the video, either on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, or wherever you happen to find it. We, we keep our eyes and ears open, so we will find you, <laughs> and we will get your question up here on the air. So, you know, keep howling, my friends, and... Ask Howler. <laughs>